everybody. Just watched Rygar the Destroyer's coverage of this R2 unit. He is the 12 inch scale, though he's obviously not 12 inches. He fits in with the 12 inch scale or 1 6th. And this is, now he is from Force Awakens. Here is the Clone Wars R2D2. They are just a little bit different. Well, he, uh, well, this particular R2D, R2 has been beat up. I got him used. I found him without the remote. He's the remote control one. Okay. And he's just a little bit shorter. Let's see. Got my tape measure. Okay. If he is six and three quarter, he is six and a half. Let's see. Where are we at? Yeah, six and three quarters, six and a half. Yeah, that's a bunch of stuff that I'm <laughs> messing with at the time. Okay, now, like I said, okay, Rygar covered him pretty good, so I will set him over here. And he, this is the also he would work in a one sixth scale. Um, I don't want to do the division in my head for making the one sixth scale tiny a quarter of an inch shorter <laughs> but there he is and this guy has four double a's would be in there if he had any um and he has a third leg whereas this guy does not and it i think he goes forward and curves backwards now they're both dwarfed by this guy this is my, the one that I took apart, figured out what was wrong with it, still haven't gotten to fix it. And I sourced, I found a leg for him because the thing just pops off. You can see that the plastic is different from there to there to there because it came off of a totally different toy. I found it in a, like I said, in a bin full of toy parts and it fits. He is remote control, but he is wired. And I think he's from, let me look at the, 1997. 97, I'm reading, trying to read. 2008, I believe he's 2015. I want to say 2015. I'm looking for the date. I've never looked for the date on this guy. Oh, there he is. Nope, just a part number. Ah, here we go. On the insides of the legs. 2000. Eh? Hold on. Yes, 2015. 97, 2008, 2015. And I have the largest. That's the largest R2 I have. And you can see I'm a tiny little shelf of stuff that I got. He's pretty big. He is all of 18 inches tall. And he's a bubble blower. He's not an action figure. He's a bubble blower. And since I got him on screen right now, here's what he does when you hit power. See, there's no lens right there. Power button right here. This has been covered by so many other people. He just turns on. There would be bubble solution in there, but I don't want to mess it up. It gets messy. And then if I hit side to side. Now, it would be neat with the bubbles being illuminated by those bright lights. He has all the movie sounds in him. He just keeps going. He just keeps going and going and going. Okay. Okay. That's what he does. Until you turn him off. Like this. And then he turns off. Okay, that's all I got for this one. Um, there's another tiny little model rocket R2. We'll never see a rocket. Okay. And there's a... <laughs> Another R2. I'm a little R2 happy, you think? 
I think. Okay, thanks for watching. Out of here. Bye-bye.